It's the ESFA Girls Under-16 Schools Cup, and it's between Combaton Village College and Kingsdale Foundation School. Who's going to settle into it first? Izzy Callahan, who I'm told always likes to research the next opponents. Gets uh, all the background she can, maybe a future manager, but she's not a bad player by the look of it, Callahan, And she's away down the left here with the cutback. Might be an early chance, and it just runs away from Gwen Davis-Jones. Uh, well, that was a really good burst down the left by Callahan, And might have the chance here, what a goal! Right-footed into the corner, third minute. It's Izzy Callahan on the mark. A fabulous moment for her and a fantastic start from Combaton Village College and their fans are absolutely loving it. She started that move with a purposeful run down the left and made no mistake with the finish. A good ball in, Madeline Wellen tried to get on there but what a pure strike of the football. Comfortably. And the girls threw a party for her on the minibus which was a great gesture. I'm sure that meant a lot to Aaliyah. Shows that togetherness, popular part of the team. Here's the shot on the turn. Oh, she spilled it. And they're back on terms. Keeper couldn't hold that long-range effort. And that's an impressive comeback from Kingsdale Foundation School. And it's their fans' turn to celebrate. One apiece. And really well taken as well. Is our Alano Barnes by Iris Lacey got the shot away. It was difficult for Liv Barker Hercock to hold. Very accomplished player. Spears it in. Here's a breakaway. And she's off and running now. And it finds its way to Madeline Wellham. Wellham. Tries to play it for Winnie, it was Gwen Davis-Jones. It's starting the move, she goes down, it's a penalty. Huge moment. Jenna Winnie wins the spot kick. Determination to get to the ball first. She goes down, she gathers the ball. The skipper, it was the substitute who thought she was going to get there, but she's just intervened. Brilliant from Winnie. Up against Madeline Atwell. Huge moment this. The outstanding Jenna Winnie, the captain scores! Superb spot kick from a superb young talent. And it's the captain who's delivered on the big stage. She hit the bar with an outrageous free kick earlier on. She won the penalty. She converted it. She's ecstatic to score. She's given an all-action display. This has been a captain's effort in every sense of the phrase. Better captain's performance than we've witnessed from Jenna Winnie in this game. Brilliant. She wasn't going to miss that. The straight up the other end, though, showing their response, their spirit. They've got a very good captain in Singer Norsworthy, and they've got a good sub here in Khaldun. The scoring might not be over. It's their captain. Singer Norsworthy scores! Anything the Combaton Village skipper can do, the captain of Kingsdale Foundation can do herself. Leading from the front, Brilliant celebration, excellent strike, 2-2. What drama we've seen this week at Stoke City and what a game this has been. Just after Jenna Winnie had rifled home the penalty, it's the other captain, Lola Singer-Norsworthy, blasting low, blasting true. Two apiece, are we set for penalties? Jenna Winnie, is there anything she can't do? Sliced away, there's the final whistle, brings to an end. A brilliant game of football. 2-2 between Combaton Village College and Kingsdale Foundation School. Nothing to choose between them in the end. And it goes to penalty kicks. A shootout to come to close the day's entertainment. Yet yeah, he wasn't ready, simple as that. Take two. Oh, and she's missed. She hits the inside of the post. And away by keeper Barker, Hercock. Well, she scored her first penalty. 
but the referee asked it to be retaken. He wasn't ready. And, well, hit the inside of the post and then the trailing leg. So it might have gone in, actually, off the post. So that goes down as a save. Jenna Winnie, the captain, brilliant, blasts it high. That was unstoppable. Well, you expected her to score. And they have the advantage already after one penalty each. Combaton Village College. Great pen. One nil to Combaton Village. And that one's wide. They're in trouble now. Kingsdale Foundation School. As it drifts agonisingly adjacent. And it's a tough, tough moment. And good captaincy there from Singer Norsworthy. Wellham. Oh, what a save! Madeline Wellen denied by the legs of Madeline Atwell. She wins the battle of the Madelines there. Remarkable, and they're still in this. Only one of the four penalties scored. She decided to go down the middle. Oh, that's one of the best saves you'll see. Iris Lacey scores. Wonderful, driven firmly into the corner. It's 1-1, their first successful spot kick. Iris Lacey got the better of Lib Barker Hercock. Now the pressure is all on this third pen. Like she struck the ball in scoring the first goal of the game, rolls it in. So calm, so cool, so accurate. That's pure class from Izzy Callahan. What a wonder of a right boot she has. Great goal earlier from open play, and she just slid it in. Nothing to worry about. Izar Alano Barnes. She hauled them level from close range to make it 1 1 earlier on. Fourth penalty. Drilled in by Alano Barnes. She's had a good day. Successful. And it's 2-2. They're level again. They've come back well here after failing from their first two. Olivia Wallen with the left boot. Oh, pings it in. A thing of beauty, that strike. Well, her twin was unsuccessful. Oh, that's sisterly love. Absolutely brilliant. An embrace between the two Wellhams. One twin failed, one twin scores, but they live, they rise and fall together. Well, she has to score. Wanda Rattaj. If she doesn't, it's all over. It's their last penalty. You can sense the tension. Wanda Rattage into the corner. Well, it was such a crucial penalty, and she acted like she was just stroking in a simple pass on the training pitch. Fantastic penalty, and she deserves the smile. 3-3. Three, three. How are your nerves, Gwen Davis-Jones? Kisses the ball. Gwen Davis-Jones to win it and does so! The number nine comes up trumps. They've won the penalty shootout by four goals to three. A thrilling spectacle. This is the Under-16 Schools Cup for Girls final that had absolutely everything. Quality goals, passion, enthusiasm. It's won one way, then the other. Comebacks. Assured penalties, brilliant moments, and it's Cobberton Village who win the cup. Played a vital role in this victory, inspired the team, and they didn't let her down.
There's the moment. Triumphant, delighted, ecstatic. And they worked so, so hard to get this win.